Now to the latest on the coronavirus here in Georgia. Today, more than 3,700 new cases have been reported, bringing the total number to 165,188. 53 people have died, bringing the death toll now to nearly 3,500. And so far, 277 people have been hospitalized today. Fulton, Gwinnett, and DeKalb counties remain at the top of the list with the most cases in our state. And you know, with such high numbers in DeKalb, officials there are taking safety measures into their own hands. CBS 46's Ayani Hughes explains. According to the Department of Public Health, there are more than 10,000 confirmed cases in DeKalb County alone. But DeKalb County officials are doing their part in stopping the spread. Right. We got different bags. As a citizen of DeKalb, it is my a responsibility to do everything I can to protect and serve our citizens from this deadly disease. Michael Thurmond, along with DeKalb County Police and Fire and Rescue, went door to door Saturday morning, handing face masks and safety kits to every business owner they could find. Uh, Y'all want to go in? Yeah, I do. Wearing masks is the most effective way to protect yourself, protect your family and the citizens of our county. This comes on the first day since the county's mask mandate went into effect, requiring DeKalb residents over the age of eight to use a face covering or mask when in any public place. We're going in the Brown Bobby shop. We're very, very happy that he actually showed up and uh, you know, he's concerned about us and he's concerned about the welfare of the people in the county. You want to pass out yeah. a kit? The hope is to encourage small businesses to implement a no mask, no service policy one already in motion at nail time. I love the policy, that's why I'm here. With DeKalb County being a county with one of the highest cases in Georgia, the hope is every mask given can save a life. We know it works, we just have to encourage more people to wear masks, to social distance, to wash hands frequently. Reporting in DeKalb County, Ayani Hughes, CBS 46 News.